Well, well, well. I smell a conservative lurking around my IG page. Let's get it. There was a time black conservatives and black Republicans had respect. Back when you had, you know, Cohen Powell. Of course, he left the party before he died. Condoleezza Rice. Even Michael Steele. As you can see, he has nothing to do with the Republican Party either. Because conservatives put their own personal interests over the interests of the country. Case in point, you out here rolling with Newsmax? Come on, man. That's not even credible. It's not even incredible. Newsmax is so far right of uh, Fox fake news. It's pure propaganda. Straight Kool-Aid drinkers. You're the same one that's out here trying to promote Trump. And you try to run for uh, a congressional seat in California. Let me help you out, man. 90% of black women voted against Trump. 70% of black men voted against Trump. Because we don't get our information from Newsmax and Facebook memes. You think that Democrats are with the Confederacy? Who took that treasonous Confederate flag into the rotunda? Who took that treasonous Confederate flag in front of the Black Museum? MAGA. That's who. MAGA has nothing for black people except bullshit and lies. And they use conservatives like yourself to push their white supremacy talking points. You out here with Flag Cruz and the other idiot who tried to overthrow our damn democracy. This is why I cannot respect any, any conservative. You all talk from the same uh, talking points. Anti-vax and anti-science. Check. Homophobic and transphobic. Check. It's the same talking points. You want to talk about corruption, but you're still praying to Lord Trump. The one who got freaking over 30,000 lives out here. Over 4,000 court cases. Multiple trials against him. His entire family is corrupt. Crooked Kushner. Ivanka the Terrible. Eric the Idiot. Coked out Don Jr. The whole lot of them is corrupt. That's why I say conservatives serve one purpose and one purpose only. To uphold the tenets of white supremacy.